Tonight, Tony Edwards has a report on a karate champion who is considered the all-time greatest in his sport. 19 years ago, Joe Lewis in red earned his black belt in karate. And since then, the living legend has become a three-time international karate champion, a world heavyweight kickboxing king, and is regarded as the greatest martial arts fighter of all time. By the Illustrated Magazine, they voted me the, uh, the greatest fighter of all time. And uh, fortunately, Chuck Wallace and Bill Wallace, who tied for second place, also voted me in on that. So I felt kind of good about it. Lewis will conduct a three-hour fighting seminar Friday night at the St. Petersburg Beach Recreation Center beginning at 7 p.m. Basically, I'll be specializing in speed and theoretical fighting. Uh, I may work on a mechanical level such things as showing someone how to improve their footwork, maybe how to improve their speed of a particular technique such as a punch or a kick. Ten years ago, competitors fought without protective gear. Today, they have foam rubber padding for their feet, four-ounce gloves for their hands, and it does save wear and tear on the body. It's mainly for safety, so we can make contact, anywhere from light contact to fairly sufficient contact without hurting your opponent, without necessarily bruising your opponent or drawing blood or making any type of cuts. Martial arts have been good to Lewis. He has traveled most of the world, made movies, conducted seminars, and now he's writing books. Tony Edwards, Newswatch 8 Sports, St. Petersburg.